Hey, Homer, slow down. You're gonna choke or something. Don't tell me how to eat donuts. Hey, look at this. Softball starts this week. Softball? Who's next? Nah, count me out. Away. What's the matter with you guys? Homer, last year we were 2 and 28. I have a secret weapon. Hmm. Come here, boy. I want to show you something. Something told me this was a very special, very magical piece of wood that I could make a bed out of. Holy, come to bed. Homer, go back to the garage. Okay, let's go over the ground rules. You can't leave first until you chug a beer. Attention all units, attention all units. Armored car being robbed at 50... Turn May. off that damn radio! And the next man wants to hit the ball, too. Man, stop that! Okay, Homer, base is loaded and you're up. Where's that secret weapon? Check it out, boys. Can I get you a beer? No, I want to get him a beer. Kids, kids, kids. You can each get me a beer. Hey, I got my magic bat off a piano. My sister let me use her wooden leg. Did you hear that, Harry? My boys need only to thump your tub, and the title is ours. Ha! The gladiators from my power plant will crush your team like nine flabby grapes. I disagree. Would you care to bet a million dollars on that? Smithy, as I've been thinking, is it wrong to cheat in order to win a million dollar bet? Yes, yeah, sir. Professional baseballers. We'll give them token jobs at the plant and have them play on our softball team. Homeless Wagner, Cap Anson, Mordecai Three Finger Brown. Uh, sir? It... In fact, your, your right fielder has been dead for 130 years. You have 24 hours. I get $50,000 to play one game? <laughs> That's right, Mr. Kansaka. Well, it's a pay cut. Are you Mike Sosha? That's me. Uh, how do you like working for the Dodgers? Well, it's okay, but sometimes I wish I had something a little more blue-collar. You know, with big machines and cool dials and stuff, like an oil refinery or a hydroelectric plant. Excuse me, are you Ozzie Smith? Yes. I have a proposition for you. <laughs> Yes, yes, I am. Come in, come in. Can I get you something? What's your name? Now I'd like to introduce the new members of our Happy Power Plant family. Roger Clemens. Hello. Sir Wade Boggs. How you doing? Ken Grippy Jr. Hey, what's up, guys? Don Mattingly, Daryl Strawberry, Ozzy Smith, Mike Sosha, and Jose Canseco. Oh, Whoa. Oh, okay. yeah. Well done. You, Sosha, sign up. Thanks just the same, but I'm here to run the solid contaminant encapsulator. One more outburst like that, and I'll send you back to the big leagues. Me and the guys worked so hard to get to the championship game, and now we'll be sitting on a bench. You had so many home runs this year. What makes you think the sterile strawberry character is better than you? Gotcha. Can't win, don't try. As your new manager, I want to say this up front. No one is assured a spot in the starting lineup. I don't care if your name is Steve Sachs or Daryl Strawberry or... Smith is what's one of the bad players' names? Homer Simpson, sir. Try some. <laughs> wow. It's like there's a party in my mouth, and everyone's invited. Excellent. Now, let's begin our training, shall we? Smithers, the medicine balls. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you going to do with your million dollars, sir? Oh, I don't know. Throw it in the pile, I suppose. You are all very good players. I got it! I got it! Yes! 
Hey, I call for that. Hey, Sosha, I don't get it. You're a ringer, but you hear every night in the core busting your butthole and radioactive waste. Well, Carl, it's such a relief from the pressures of playing big league ball. I mean, there, you make any kind of mistake, and boom, the press is all over you. Uh-oh. Mattingly, get rid of those sideburns. What sideburns? You heard me, hippie. These guys aren't so tough. I've got Wonder Bat. Now, before I post the starting lineup, I want to assure those of you whose names are not on the list that I'm very disappointed in you. Please, please, I want to make the team. Clemens, did I make the team? You sure did. I did! Woohoo! Woohoo! In your face, strawberry! Wait a minute, are, are you Ken Griffey Jr.? No. Sorry, didn't mean to get your hopes up. Three misfortunes, that's possible. Seven misfortunes, there's an outside chance. But nine misfortunes, I'd like to see that. What seems to be the problem, officers? It's enough out of you, smart guy. Reach for your license. Uh, Mike, try to lift your arm. Can't lift arm or speak at normal rate. Well, I'm afraid you have a case of acute radiation poisoning, Mr. Socha. Man. Dr. Hibbert, Ken Griffey Jr. needs to see you immediately. We think it's an overdose of nerve tonic. Good Lord. Gigantism. Ah! My cat! Never fear, ma'am. I'll save your cat. <gasps> My player piano! Oh, man. And I say England's greatest prime minister was Lord Palmerston. Hit the elder. Lord Palmerston! Hit the elder! Okay, you asked for it, Bugs! Ah! Don't I at least get to call my lawyer? You watch too many movies, Sax. How long does it take to see this thing? I'm kind of in a hurry. Well, it's hard to say, my friend. Once you go in, you may never come out. Wow! One, please. <laughs> Manningly, for the last time, get rid of those sideburns. Look, Mr. Burns, I don't know what you think sideburns are, but... Don't argue with me! Just get rid of them! Smithers, it's almost game time. Where the devil am I ringing? The dryer goes on the right. Yes, ma'am. <gasps> what about Clemens? Sir, he's in no condition to play. <laughs> that damn hypnotist. <gasps> Mattingly! I thought I told you to trim those sideburns. Go home. You're off the team for good. Fine. I still like him better than Steinbrenner. <clears throat> All right, you ragtag bunch of misfits, and go out there and win! Ah! Not so fast, Simpson. The man who plays your position is still here. Hit the pain. Oh. Who wants peanuts? We got peanuts. Hey, whoa! Oh, peanuts is good. Hey, peanuts, we got peanuts. Need some peanuts? Heads up! <laughs> I told him to do that. Brilliant strategy, sir. Oh. All right. Tie game, bottom of the ninth. Two outs, bases loaded. Strawberry coming up. Wait. You, Strawberry. I'm putting in a right-handed batter to hit for you. What? You're pitch hitting for me? Simpson, you're batting for Strawberry. I am? Woohoo! Hello, boy, Homer. You can do it. All right, Simpson, let's go over the signals. If I tuck the bill at my cap like so, yes. it means the signal is a fake. I wish I was home with a big bag of potato chips. Mm, potato chips. Got that, Simpson? Yes, sir. Now, batting for Daryl Strawberry. Over. Huh? <gasps> oh, dear. No, Mom, it counts as a hit. Dad just won the game. Well, I guess I'll be happy when he comes too.